Good morning, everybody. It's Trish. I am out here today to go over and review the concept that I teach that was taught to me, which is the concept that was created by Ernest Jones and Ernest Jones passed it on to Angel Delatore. Angel Delatore passed it on to his son, Manuel Delatore, who is my teacher, and passed it on to those of us that continue to teach this concept. Now, I was introduced to this concept by a woman named Pat Kimball. And Pat Kimball was Manuel Delatore's student for years. And once I discovered or was introduced to this concept, I've never really looked back. And in today's world, we call it club focused instruction. Okay. And that means we focus on what the golf club is doing throughout the swing. That is not to say we don't talk about what part of our body creates those motions with the golf club. What it is, is we allow ourselves to swing the club and focus on swinging the club and letting our body respond to that. Now, with this concept, we believe, those of us that teach this concept, that the backswing is created and started with our hands, both hands. We believe the club is swung back over our trail shoulder with our hands and our body, the center of that swing, responds to that motion. We also believe that once we are at the top of our backswing, the forward swing is started with our arms, our arms being the triceps, biceps. That's our forearm. This is our arm. So with both arms, the start of the forward swing is with both arms. And once again, our body responds to that motion. Now, how do we get a sense of both hands and both arms working together? A lot of the times you will see professionals take a ball and they will put it in between their arms, like their forearms like this, so they can keep that connection of both arms working together. I'm not a big fan of the ball simply because we concentrate more on the ball and not on the club, but it's one way to do it. The other way people do it is to take a band and they take this band and they put it over their forearms, okay? So they put it like this. Now they put the club in their hands and they swing the club with both hands and both arms around their body. Now, if you require an aid to accomplish this, I would prefer this over the ball. And the only reason I, I don't like the ball so much is because it can fall out and things like that. But if you require a outside stimuli, so to speak, to swing this club, put the band at the base of your elbows. And now we swing hands to the trail shoulder, arms to the finish in the direction of the target. Does that make sense? So once you've practiced that or kind of visualized that, all we have to do is now focus on those things. So we are gonna swing hands, or we're gonna swing the club, excuse me. We're gonna swing the club with our hands to the trail shoulder, and we're gonna swing the whole club with our arms to the finish in the direction of the target. Make sense? So I hope this helps. I hope that this is a way for you to look at the game in a whole new light. So until next time, please stay safe.
stay healthy and of course keep it in the short grass.